now we will start with physiology of cerebellum fibers reaching directly to the purkinje cells of cerebellum arise from which of the following first we will quickly go through the physiology there are five cells in the cerebellar cortex which are these five granular cells which is also called granule cells basket cells golgi cells purkinje cells and stellate cells write it down it's very important now how to remember all these cells i am having a very beautiful mnemonic for you guys these are bela ne garden ki basket mein gol phool sajaye hain this bela is cerebellar got it now garden is granule cells basket is basket cells gol is golgi cells p is for purkinje cells and sajaye hain is for stellate cells so this is the way you will remember all these five cells which are present in cerebellar cortex okay now remember there are four deep cerebellar nuclei what are these four dentate nuclei emboliform globus and fastigial and remember from lateral to medial they are d e g f that is don't eat greasy food this is the mnemonic for remembering these nuclei from lateral to medial side so there are four deep nuclei which are present in cerebellar medulla and in cerebellar cortex there are five cells now here this portion is cerebellar cortex it's having five cells purkinje basket cells stellate cells golgi cells granular cells this is a cerebellar medulla that is deeper part of the cerebellum it's having deep nuclei which are four in number which i told you just now so remember afferents which are going to the cerebellum are coming in the form of two fibers first is the climbing fibers okay and the second fiber is the mossy fibers these two fibers are carrying information to the cerebellum from different parts of the body mainly climbing fibers they are going directly to the purkinje cells and these climbing fibers are coming from which area coming from inferior olivary nucleus I'll write it down climbing fibers is coming only from inferior olivary nucleus and they are going upward towards the cerebellar cortex and stimulating which cell stimulating purkinje cell write it down now what about mossy then remember mossy fibers are coming that is they are efferent they are coming and stimulating the granule cells write it down mossy fibers stimulating granule cells and remember mossy fibers are coming from all parts of the brain stem from the spinal cord except inferior olivary nucleus so why except because inferior olivary nucleus information is going through the climbing fibers so mossy fibers are going and ending on the granular cells and they are stimulating granular cells remember whenever granule cell gets stimulated they will sense axons and form parallel fibers in the cerebellar cortex upper layer of cerebellar cortex and why are these parallel fibers these granule cells stimulate purkinje cells basket cell and stellate cells and golgi cells so in turn you can say that granular cells are stimulatory to the to the purkinje cell to the basket cell to the stellate cell and to the golgi cells and now you can see purkinje cells are now stimulated what will happen after that purkinje cell as soon as they stimulated they will inhibit deep nuclei remember write it down purkinje fibers will inhibit the deep nuclei and deep nuclei remember when there is no purkinje cell inhibition then normally deep nuclei are sending excitatory fibers to the cortex and to the brain stem but this stimulation that is this excitation of the deep nuclei is inhibited by the purkinje cell so in short you can say that purkinje are inhibiting the deep nuclei that's it now one most important thing here you should remember that when purkinje is inhibiting at the same time there are basket cell and stellate cell which was excited by granule cells 
they in turn inhibit the Purkinje cell. Got it? So, here you can say that granule cell is the only cell present in the cerebellar cortex which are excitatory in nature. While if you see Purkinje cell, basket cell, still air cells, Golgi cells, they all are inhibitory in nature. It means whenever these cells, these four cells get stimulated, they will inhibit the other nuclei. Got it? Just write it down. Okay. Now, remember that these efferent to the cerebellum are very important. Most of the questions are asked from this topic. So, just, so just see carefully. Mossy fibers and climbing fibers, I told you just now, mossy fibers are carrying information from all other parts that is from the brain stem, from the spinal cord and it is going and ending on the granule cells. But what about climbing fibers? Climbing fibers is coming from inferior olivary nucleus, correct? And it is ending on Purkinje cell, got it? Now, I told you it is very important. So, now how to remember it? I am having a blockbuster mnemonic again for you and this is Singham Polis. Now, let us see carefully. Singham is having G in it. So, here granule cell is G. M is mossy. Singham, granule cell, mossy fibers, got it. What about this P? Purkinje cell, Oli is olivary nucleus and C is climbing fiber. Climbing fiber, olivary nucleus, and Purkinje cell. So, for this connection, for this affront, you just remember Singham Polis, that is it, and you will get your answer. Got it? Now, one most important thing I told you that the, just now, here you just remember the one important fruit that is grey. Why I am saying that? Grey is granule cells, P is parallel and E is excitatory. I told you previously that granule cells exons goes up and form the parallel fibers. So, granule cells form parallel fibers and granule cell is the only cell which are excitatory in nature. Got it? So, you should remember the word that is a fruit grape for your cerebellum. Now, one more thing you should remember is spine. For what? P is for Purkinje cell, I is for inhibitory, N is for deep nuclei, E is for excitatory. What does it mean? Remember, Purkinje cells are inhibitory to the deep nuclei, while deep nuclei are excitatory. So, these are very good mnemonics you should remember for the cerebellum. Got it? Pine, grape, singham polis. Got it? Now, coming back to our question. Fibers reaching directly to the Purkinje cells of cerebellum arises from which of the following? Now, I know you can just give the answer without seeing the option. Option A, vestibular nucleus, no. Option B, inferior olivary nucleus, yeah, this is the answer. And who was bringing the information from the inferior olivary nucleus? It is climbing fibers. Got it? Now, next question is, different from cerebellum. What is the question? Efferent from the cerebellum is through which cell? Now you know the answer. Granule cells? No. Golgi cells? No. Basket cells? No. Then this is Purkinje cell. Yeah. Purkinje cells, I told you, they are ending on the deep nuclei and sending the efferent out of the cerebellum. Again question. True about the cerebellar neuronal connection. Climbing fibers are inhibitory to the Purkinje cell. No, I told you, climbing fibers are excitatory. So, this is not the answer. Mossy fibers are inhibitory to Purkinje cells. No, mossy fibers are ending on granule cells. So, this is not the answer. Climbing fibers arises from inferior olivary nucleus. Yeah, it is true. So, answer is C. What was the mnemonic? Polis. Got it? What about option D? Mossy fibers arises from inferior olivary nucleus. No, it is wrong. So, our answer is option C that is climbing fiber arises from inferior olivary nucleus. Now, question is which is only excitatory neuron in cerebellar cortex? I told you the mnemonic for that was grape. 
okay and now you know the answer the answer is granule cells what about these three these all three are inhibitory then the question is Purkinje fibers relay to which of the following amygdala caudate nucleus VLN thalamus and dentate nucleus I told you Purkinje fibers and so on deep nuclei and dentate nucleus what is dentate it is nothing but one of the four deep nuclei so the answer is dentate nucleus so see how it's easy to remember now about the cerebellum connection cerebellum efferent efferent everything okay guys and these four things you should remember in physiology of cerebellum what are these four inferior olivary climbing fibers Purkinje cells mossy fibers granule cells then mnemonic grape i told you and the mnemonic pine got it and one more mnemonic i told you is the singham polis okay guys so let's have a break of 10 seconds